Well, hey, everybody. Well, I am up on this beautiful morning getting ready to drop off some food baskets that I have been preparing for two months for the homeless shelters. And usually around this time of the year, my team and I, we usually go directly to the homeless shelter to cook a beautiful, wonderful Thanksgiving dinner. But when COVID hit, <clears throat> you know, a lot of changes have occurred. And so I got creative this year and decided to put some food baskets together. And as I was putting these baskets together and as I was grocery shopping, um, I was very mindful that these individuals only had access to a microwave. So I bought things like this, this turkey dressing and mashed potato dinner. They have oatmeal that they can have in the morning. Vienna sausages, um, chicken and dumpling. We have sweet peas in a cup, um, as well as green beans, carrots, uh, pudding. We also have lasagna and some mac and cheese here down at the bottom and also a drink. So I just want to say thank you to each and every individual that supported this project. You know who you are and I definitely know who you are. I don't take you for granted. I really appreciate all of the love and the support that you show towards Arms Open With Love Foundation. And I want you to know that I made sure that every dollar was spent well and that each dime is definitely accounted for. So thank you all so much. I'm so excited. So stay tuned. Well, the baskets are all packed in my van and ready to go. I wanna show you what I did. here is one of the baskets it's what they look like um, as you can see I covered them with plastic and I tied a ribbon around it and I also have the red color as well as you can see oh and also we are going to be making turkey sandwiches today as well you know I'm excited because I've been working on this project um, since the month of September you know there's so much that I do behind the scenes and I never like to wait to do things at the last minute I always like to uh, plan ahead of time and also because I want to make sure that I can gather up the support you know that I need so as all of my friends monthly partners and supporters as you all were sending in your cash donations through my website and through cash app you know each week you know I will go to the grocery store and I started you know stocking up on the items you know real early so that way, you know, I was able to have those items. And each week, I would take the time to just build the baskets, you know, one day at a time. So I just want to say thank y'all so much. If you want to continue to support, just visit my website at armsopenwithlove.com. You can also support my building fundraiser on my GoFundMe account. So follow me on social media. Um, and if you would like to support that as well. Well, today I'm only going to one location today. Um, there's other locations that I have planned in the upcoming weeks. So today I'm only taking enough baskets for one location. And you know what? What time is it? You know what? It's actually time for me to get out of here because I'm actually on a time schedule. So I guess I see you all later. Bye bye.
Detroit Rescue Center, mm. right? <laughs> it was a lot of people this time. A lot of people. I, I enjoyed it. A lot of laughter. Thank you. Thank you, Sophia. <laughs> Look at that. Back in business.